<laughs> Question 198. Which psychic ability would you like to have? We're working under the assumption that they're real here. <laughs> wait, what, what, wait, isn't psychic... Oh, man. Is this multiple to... choice? Is it, so it's just think, like reading you... minds, right? Well, no, okay. We're going, I, we're going with I, I most of the woo. Telekinesis, uh, pyrokinesis, you know, anything that has to do with okay. the mind. Okay. Think of okay. that. Man. I Okay. Like, would you rather be able to read minds or read people's thoughts? Would you rather be able to control people's minds and people's thoughts? Would you rather be able to move things I, I with your mind? I that all as one, that's why. The telekinesis part, I could understand separating it, pyrotechnic, or, but the, the psychic... Look, I can set shit on fire without my mind. I, I don't <laughs> yeah, no, 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 Do you know, no, no, know what's really funny? Part, Do you know what's really well, funny? Stephen King wrote a book about that. What's really funny is there's a reasonable chance, based on burgeoning technology now, in 500 years, we will have technology-based telekinesis powers. Or you, or you not, absolutely not, because we won't be around in 500 years. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Or are you saying psychic is nope. being able to read the future? We you say that? So yeah, I'll go with that. Or talk to we the have... dead. Now, I don't want to read people's minds. I definitely don't want to know the future. Fuck that. How about you moving things with your mind? Yeah, I heard about the you can get to that drawer at the end of your bed. <laughs> Any kind of mind-based ability. Yeah, pretty much. I just want to stay out of trouble for more than 24 hours. Could you not do that now? <laughs> no, I don't. It would include all, all mental capacity. So, so it's bunched up all together. Like to say what kind of psychic ability you want. I can't separate the two because yeah. if you read minds, then you know what they're thinking. Isn't it? That's, that's the same thing. You know what yes. somebody's going to do. You can control somebody. No, you, you can't control them. Mind. You can manipulate them. Right. So then there's no sub there's no difference there. Well, there is. Yes, a but, there is a difference in telekinesis where you can move stuff with your mind versus read somebody's mind. There, that's a difference. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now I don't know if there's going to be a question like that coming up but the one i do not want never ever would be uh the reading somebody else's mind because i don't want to know what anybody's thinking about me because it's usually not very good um i, right. think, I'd want, yeah. I think i'd want telekinesis to where i could you know refill this coffee cup over here mm -hmm. just by thinking it over and Perfect. getting it filled bringing it back you know that sort of thing that well, that's, just, that's just the force if you had so, telekinesis why would you want a mug why not just pull the water <laughs> yeah the, pull the coffee you know, the it, yeah there you are great wow yeah just, just have it sitting up next to you just, you know exactly <laughs> 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 like, what is that it's my coffee shut up leave me alone when I, oh God, when I used to run yeah, an Okay, would it have to be plugged in to keep the, because you could have the whole pot and everything floating next to you hot. Yeah. Yeah, you don't have to have it plugged yeah. in, right? All right, perfect. Well, if you're able to control things with your mind like that, what says you can't control the molecules and excite them, causing them to heat up? Mm. Uh -huh. yeah, okay, yeah. Yeah, no need for nothing. Psychic yeah, I'm about to say we're going into deep physics here. <laughs> That'll work. <laughs> Oh, shit. Yeah. So basically, no one wants to be able to mind read. Tarot cards. I would want to accurately be able to use tarot cards. Tarot cards. I could play poker anytime. I don't need tarot cards. <laughs> there you go. Well, that's what they were all Your tarot cards can be fun. For them to act, if they actually worked, it'd be interesting. I, I think it would be, a, it would be a great party trick. It, it would be fun to do. It could help people. And it has no accidental fuck up in this value, I'm not actually accidentally going to skewer somebody by throwing something like an art <laughs> like I would probably do if I were telekinetic. Um, you see, we, we, had, we, had, we had an interesting it, it question. It seems like a good, solid, harmless choice that has practical applications. And we I'm had an interesting that. question that might fit into this, was, was mm -hmm. if you could kill someone with your mind. Or would, you, uh, would you want to be able to kill someone with your mind? Oh, I remember that There would that be one. too many dead people around. Well, the issue yeah. was, is what if it... What yeah. it was it a one-off, or is this some potential you always have? Oh, you always have it. And the problem you've got is what happens when you lose control or fall asleep, or, or all of a sudden there's just dead if people. if you get mad at yourself and be like, oh, <laughs> goddamn, I wish I'd just die. <laughs> yes. Wow. 
that's another yeah. thing to talk about. <laughs> I do not trust myself enough to say I want that power. Exactly. That's what I, I'm saying. I think I'm the accident. potential for abuse or for yes. accident is yeah. just too high. I don't yeah, want I, that. I'm too human. Agreed. I, if you mm-hmm. gave me a choice to choose someone one time, I do it. Yeah. But um, all the yeah, time. As, I, as a one off, yeah, I can, I can see that. But yeah. But we're not going to have to get together and pick no. a different target because we can only kill one person <laughs> once. Okay, I'll be like, all right, you get yeah, that one. You get. We'd that end up we'd end up with a, a murder on the Orient Express <laughs> situation where we <laughs> the same person just falls down dead because they've been wished to death by nine different people simultaneously. <laughs> That'd be one hell of a game. Of three, right? Drops dead oh, of an aneurysm and of a. Uh, uh, cardiac arrest and falls downstairs and falls off a roof and does it all at the same time somehow. Air, airplane crashes into him, then the, the train runs over. Yeah, it, the probabilities of that deterministic situation would be amazing. <laughs> yes, absolutely. I know, right? <laughs> Suddenly, every statistician in the world is is has a job for the next hundred years. <laughs> How did this happen? I don't know. <laughs> Dave's fault. Everything's <laughs> <laughs> Dave's fault. Blame my math fake. Blame my math fake. He is the mathematician here. <laughs> there you go. Silence falls. Uh, Santi, <laughs> Santi thinks mind reading would depress I, you I was going to say, I thought that was math big. <laughs> Yeah, Santi mm-hmm. says that he thinks mind reading would depress you in seconds. Very yes, hard. absolutely. You know, like I say, I don't want to know what anybody else is thinking about me. Everybody thinks of me. So, you know. Ah, but what if they to... know you can read their minds? Say, say again? What if everyone knows you can read their minds? Oh, oh God. God. That could get really crazy yeah. really quickly because what you are describing is the story called. It's a very good day, if I remember correctly. Is that the one where the boy uh, kept disappearing people into the cornfield? Yes. I've, I've got a one. qualifying question Go on. about yes, mind sir. reading. Mm-hmm. Uh, Is there a defense against it? Is that oh, that'd mean? be the absolute fucking worst. No. Right, you, br- you broke <laughs> up right there. <laughs> Asimov's Norby books, where you had to person at a time. Like, I, you know, teach Sal's, Sal's thoughts then. Or is it like that horrible episode of Buffy the Vampire Slayer, where she can just hear the ambient room noise of the voices of every, yeah. the interior and monologues of everyone around her all the time? Because that would drive you insane in a flat she fucking did. It, second. It, it took, like, what, it, it took no time at all for her to actually just start going fucking nuts. So. Yeah. We'll see, like, oh, in, yeah. in, 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 you know, and then you got then out. you got to drink demon heart potion. It's a whole thing. <laughs> but then you got you have um uh fucking True Blood, and she can read minds, but she's done it her whole life, and she just hears everything everyone says. Or your or brain knows how to shut it out. I mean, don't yeah, forget, your funny. brain right now shuts out ninety nine point nine percent of what your body is telling it. It only hears the important like, like your sense yeah. of smell. Yes, you know you can like, be in a room with a smell, and and you only smell it the first handful of seconds, depending on what it is. Yeah, like in you know in Star Trek, they have a species that reads minds, the Betazoids, and in oh, yeah. okay. comics, whatever. Um, they'll tell you that basically they just it's kind of like white noise. You end up ignoring most of it. But the way you want to throw a telepath off is to keep a song or poetry in your head and just constantly repeat it. Mm. It's like mm-hmm. it might drive you half, half mad, but it's going to do the same thing to the telepath trying to read you. Mm. Yeah, they, they had a, a very similar approach on uh, uh, Babylon 5. Then mm. you just, you know, you sing row, row, row your boat or whatever. And the, <laughs> and the psychops can, can always hear a sort of ambient room noise, but they're trained to shut it out or keep it down to a manageable level. So are we, yeah, are they're, we, they're like, no, do, do, do we have, do we have this disagreement <laughs> proud that no one wants to be able to read minds? Pretty sure we're all nerds here, but <laughs> yes, Jass is a super nerd. So, okay, okay. so no it. one wants to be able to read minds. Fuck no. no. Nah. Fuck no. Oh, we have it. Nope. No. I spurned the gift. <laughs> and some we looked of... it in the mouth thoroughly, but then we sent it back. <laughs> <laughs> and some of you want telekinesis. Telekinesis, yeah, I do. Telekinesis. That I could deal with. And, and how about uh, no one wants pyrokinesis? 
I don't think you could do no, it with telekinesis. I can't on fire by myself. I don't need it. <laughs> yeah, the, the um, telekinesis could handle that. Yeah. <laughs> right. I can manipulate electricity. That comes under telekinesis. You're right. Okay. So <laughs> we good. 